What's going on, people? And, uh, wow, is all I can say. This new Batman movie that Matt Reeves is putting together seems to be one for the ages. I mean, I have not seen or heard about so many characters in a movie uh, since since the animated series. Since And, and that seems like that's the direction that it's going. Um, we already know and, and it's been confirmed that Robert Pattinson is playing batman he's playing playing a younger batman a more uh unseasoned batman so to speak where he's just getting into the role of batman he's still a detective he's still hanging around the crime scenes he's not the big brooding batman that we saw with ben affleck he's more of a slim slim slimmer build uh batman but smart detective crime scene putting clues together also in this movie you have the Riddler, who's going to be one of the main antagonists in this movie, and he's going to be uh, leaving clues, he, uh, you know, uh, uh, signs on the walls and lights and things like that. So he's going to be, these characters are going to be in true comic book form. Um, now it's said that in addition to the Riddler, Penguin, Firefly, Catwoman, we now can add Mad Hatter and harvey two-face or just two-face it hasn't been confirmed as hard is if harvey dent is going to be uh in the movie and then become uh two-face or how that's going to work but two-face is said to be in the movie the penguin <clears throat> the penguin from the description i'm getting now the penguin is going to be a mob boss so that makes sense to have all of these characters all of these villains in this movie because someone has to be the mob boss the mob have has to have the mob mentality and I see that. I see a bunch of henchmen. I see Two-Face. I see alliances being made, broken. Uh, Firefly, I'm still I'm still trying to get a, a grip on, on him. I know in the comic books as a kid, he wasn't allowed to go into certain restaurants, certain bars, and do certain things. So he's an arsonist. He's going to be burning shit down left and right. So I, I see that out of him. Um, but now how long he's going to stay in the movie, I don't know. In, in, in the video game, he didn't last long. I think so you had to chase him down a couple of times. And then as soon as you call, you knew who he was right out the gate. Because um, he, he used a particular uh, fuel. And it was easy to track. And, and and you could hunt him down. So I see that happening. Um, rather quickly just to get you get get your ears perked. Get you on the ed edge of the seat. But uh, from what I'm seeing and what I'm hearing. Uh, through uh, Geek Squad and another source. Um that Matt Reeves is putting together one hell of a cast and villains for this Batman movie. So just stay tuned. Like I said, this is Master, this is Sergeant Alexander from the Master Assassin's Clan. Man, I'm, I'm staying on top of this movie because, like I said, I had my doubts, as everyone else did, with, with Robert Pattinson being Batman. But uh, Matt Reeves is, is directing it. So uh, I'm, I'm starting to warm up to it more that from what I'm seeing and what I'm hearing that it's starting to look more and more like a very good Batman movie, maybe the best Batman movie all time. Um, uh, Robert, uh, Matt Reeves is currently overseas developing, uh, the scenes, the, uh, the, the city of Gotham. He's, 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 oh, he's building the DC universe for us. This Batman movie, he's building, he's building Gotham city right now. He's getting the layout, what he wants the, 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 uh, the mansion and the bat cave and everything to look like and then how this movie is going to come together he's actually currently doing that right now so like i said i'm kind of anxious and, and 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 ready to see what's uh what's what's coming to, to be uh this movie is set to release in 2021 actually june 25th 2021 is the actual release date that's planned um for this movie uh filming will start the beginning of next year the first quarter of next year so um like they, these guys have hit the ground running um so we already know who the villains are it's just now to start the time to start casting i know people have been throwing their names out there in in for certain villains i know uh batista wanted to be bane i don't see batista playing bane but he did say if it was offered the position to him he would accept i did see that on his uh twitter account i Personally, I think Nathan Jones would make a better Bane. Um, I have to research and see exactly how tall Robert Pattinson is, but it wouldn't make sense for Bane to be shorter than Batman. 
that's not going to work. So whoever's going to play Bane has to be tall, has to be big and bulky. Um, me personally, I said either Nathan Jones or Brock Lesnar. Neither one of those have, have people have thrown their names in the hat as far as I can see. But uh, you, you, you don't know. But I do know that Batista did say and threw his name out there to play Bane in uh, Matt Reeves' Batman movie. So we'll just have to see. Um, like I say, I'm anxious for it. I want to see what's going to happen. Um, and, and that's it, man. Like I say, please go ahead. And if you're new to the channel, please go ahead. Give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell notification so that you will know each and every time I go online and post something new or I'm just live streaming that you can join in and, and see what, what's going on and what new news and information I have for you. Um, so with that being said, man, it's Southern Alexander 158. I will catch you guys later with more news on the Batman movie and, and TV shows as, as I hear about them and confirm that they are true. I will be dropping that information right here on this channel. See you later. We in hell.